But it's we we called this out several months ago on how crazy this election cycle was going to be, and there were going to be hiccups and hurdles and things that are going to happen. You know, I didn't have on my bingo card two assassination attempts. I had one. You know, I didn't think two in this short amount of time. And I said this yesterday that a video that went viral um, that, hey, they're, they're not going to stop. Even when President Trump wins in November, if they allow, you know, prop, and we're going to get into voting here in a second because I want to talk about what you, what you found and what you're going to talk about today if they don't cheat. Um, and if he gets in, they're going to continue to try to assassinate him. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. You know, I think that I wasn't expecting a second assassination attempt either. And the the thing about this, the, one of the, the big messages of this is that they are clearly afraid that we're going to overcome their fraud. They, they are going to cheat. I mean, they, they, they there's always been election fraud. Um, and I think that they're going to cheat in the same way that they did in 2020. And we'll talk more about how I, how I believe that is. Uh, but the good news there is that we can't overcome it. And they clearly believe that we can overcome it. They wouldn't have bothered to do this and you know had uh had they not had that fear so the voter turnout is going to be crazy um it, there's going to be an extreme amount of people voting in this election and that's why it's too big to rig as president trump consistently says um in his interviews in rallies and everything else and it, it's going to be interesting how that all plays out and the reason being is because the country is literally on fire in that video that i talked about that i did yesterday the Democrats and their policies, they literally threw gasoline on our entire country and you, the American voter, are ha hold the match and it's lit.